Hello everyone, this is Michael, the Prophet Dreamer. Please check me out at www.profitdreamer.com. Today I want to talk to you about my uh, background here. So most of my videos I've been shooting with this chalk background. I've tried other backgrounds, background frames and hung backgrounds, bought cheap backgrounds off Amazon. Wasn't always happy, but I, the chalk background I like mainly because it's in my office and I have my do-it-yourself Home Depot lights up here. It's my computers in here. It's really easy for me to come in here and shoot. And so I'm, this is really the place that I've been shooting. But I'm really not 100% happy with this chalkboard. But, um, and this is like a paint on chalkboard. The kids come in here and draw on it and you know, it gets dirty and I'm always having to clean it. I've got another video out there how to clean this chalkboard with Coke. I'll put a link to the, uh, that video down in the description. But today I want to talk to you about this new backdrop that I just got off Amazon. This is a Kate backdrop, Kate backdrop that I got off Amazon, and I'll put a link down in the description for that too. And it's thirty-four dollars and eighty cents, and it's five by seven. And above me, I've, you can't see it, but I've, I'm holding on to a curtain rod that I held here. So I want to make this video just to show it, open it up. I'm not really big into unboxing videos doesn't really do you any good if you see me unboxing something something you can see on Amazon we're gonna unbox this and see what it looks like and then we're gonna see if we can get the wrinkles out and if it's actually gonna help now one of the reasons why I'm using this is because uh, it's a lot heavier than that $14 one I bought um, nice plastic bag whatever we're gonna open it up here um, and so of course I expect it to be wrinkly but it, it is it is a lot heavier i can tell out already and this is a five by seven and i paid 34 dollars 80 for it and like i said i'll put a uh i'll put a uh, uh link in the description so that's what it looks like um we're gonna hang this up and we're gonna see how wrinkly it is i can already tell there's kind of a lot of lint on it uh, but we'll get that all cleaned up so let's hang this up now, one of the reasons why you can see that my light switch is here, I'll turn lights off, lights on, and I don't like this light switch in my videos, and I could crop it out, but you start cropping and you start losing some other aspects that you want in the video. So let's get this hung up, and then we'll see if we can put it in the dryer for like 15 minutes, get some of the wrinkles out, then we'll steam it and get all the lint off. So we'll be right back. So that background is up, and that's not too bad. Obviously, we have creases from it being in the package, and there's a lot of lint on it. I'll have to get a brush and brush out all. So, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put this in the dryer for like 10, 15 minutes. It says it's washable. There was a nice uh, ring up here for me to slide my pole through, so that's good. Um, you know, I was worried that it wasn't gonna be long enough, but it, it could be. And it is five by seven, so if it isn't, I could turn it the other way and that would work. I would just have to put some clamps up there because the seven foot thing uh, doesn't have the pole slots. But so another thing we're gonna do now, we got a tape measure while we're here. Let's see if it's actually five foot. So I'm gonna measure this. And it actually, yeah, it's, 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 it's five foot. It's like 59 and a half, but I'm sure if we stretch it a little bit, It'll get there. So we're gonna put this in the uh, dryer and we'll see, this is a cape backdrop. I got it off Amazon. I'll put a link down below. Um, I kind of wish I would have got a little, maybe a little grayer color. We'll see how it turns out. We'll be right back. We're gonna put it in the uh, dryer for 15 minutes, see if we can get some wrinkles out. Okay, we're back and then we put the uh, backdrop in the dryer with the wet towel for about 20 minutes and as you can see a lot of the creases and wrinkles have come out now i knew to do that but when i uh, opened the box this was inside the package and it says when you open your package you may notice wrinkles don't panic this is common from shipping simply toss in a dryer with a damp cloth for 15 to 20 minutes and that's exactly what we did and um, we did get all the wrinkles out now 
Um, am I happy with this? This is definitely a, a better backdrop than the $14 one I had or $14.99 one I had. Um, but, um, and we can see that we can know, like we now have, there's the um, uh, light switch that's hidden. And I, and I can get a little wider angle now because there's also a door here that I'm hiding. And I'll have to play with it. And I will admit that um, the camera angle might be slightly changed. I took it down. And this has actually been hanging for like 24 hours. So maybe gravity pulled some of the wrinkles out. But it looked pretty good right after it came out of the dryer. Um, now, what we want to do now is I, I think most of the wrinkles out, but what I have here is a handheld steamer, something you can just get from Walmart. I got it as a Christmas present and we'll turn it on. And as you can see, steam is starting to come out and I will just steam this real quick and see if that helps anymore. And then um, we'll report back. So let's steam this real quick. And I'm only going to try to steam the part where you can see me. I'm not going to steam the whole thing. So let's get to it. Okay, so I don't know if you could tell if that helped or anything. I think that um, it was, um, it looked pretty good just coming out the dryer, putting the dryer for 15 minutes, 20 minutes, but obviously it's not gonna hurt to steam it. Now, am I happy with it? Yeah, so far I'll have to, you know, edit it and look and see what post-processing does. But um, the only um, slight, thing that's giving me some anxiety about it maybe not anxiety but maybe I'm not exactly happy with is I wish it was longer but that's my own fault and also I probably could have ordered a slightly different color maybe something bluish maybe something greenish only because you know to be honest the um, chalkboard wasn't bad and this is pretty close to the same color as the chalkboard now of course I don't have to worry about cleaning the chalkboard this was only $34.80 and if Kate Backdrops wants to send me another one to review, you know, I'll do that. Uh, that's a hint to you, Kate Backdrops, if you see this video. But I think what we'll do is, not in this video, because I, I really want to get a wider shot. I'd like to get a shot of me, and I guess I could stand back some, and with the right camera and the right lens, uh, maybe with a DSLR, we could do something different. But I'm, am I unhappy with it? No. And you know, we'll see, I'll look at it in post-processing and we'll take a look. So this is Michael the Prophet Dreamer. Um, this really, I don't know, I don't really wanna call this a review. This is just me walking through the steps as I go through this process of making 100 videos for this YouTube channel. Um, it was Kate Backdrops, got it off Amazon for $34.80. And I will put that link in the description like I said before. If this type of video interests you, you know, we would appreciate it if you just please subscribe and smash that notification bell. That way you'll know when we upload another video about this type of subject. Because I'm probably going to order another backdrop. I'm probably also going to turn this backdrop the other way. So it's, you know, seven foot this way instead of five foot. So I can get a little wider angle. I'll have to get some clamps for that. So please um, subscribe. This is Michael, the Profit Dreamer. Check out our blog at ProfitDreamer.com. Thank you.